Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Elba and today I'm going to be doing a pretty short cash stuffing for some saving challenges. We are not going to be stuffing a lot because I don't really have a lot of money. But um, I have, I believe, $43 that I'm going to be stuffing today. Um, it's been quite a bit since I did a stuffing for my savings challenges. It's been rough lately. I did overspend in January. I'm, I think next paycheck, I should be all caught up with everything and kind of back to normal. But uh, February was not the best month. But hey, we learn and we move on and we try to make things better. So um, thank you guys for tuning in and just thank you to anybody that uh, has been subscribing. We kind of been growing the past couple of days. So thank you guys and welcome to my channel. So um, let's see. So we have 10, 20, 30, 35, 40 and 41 42 43 it's gonna be a short video you guys we're not really gonna be stuffing a lot again don't really have that much money to work with but a little bit is better than nothing so uh let's see my little dashboard you guys so cute so we're gonna be starting with the something i love saving challenge this one is gonna get ten dollars and I love coloring these in on camera. So let me see. Let me grab a tin. I feel like it's like my first time stuffing since it's been such a while. I'm pretty nervous right now. So hopefully I'm like, I don't end up shaking the camera or anything. So this now has $30 in this little mini challenge. Put it back in. And then let's do... I've been doing 10 on this one. I said I was going to just pick a random number and just write the the amount down but I think 10 has been working okay so and I want to do 10 so let's see how that goes do 10 here let's put this back in I love coloring these on camera. I don't know if you guys are the same way. I love seeing other people do it on camera. I don't know why. It just seems like fun. Rainy day fund. Let's see. Let's do $5 for this one. Yeah. Let's do $5 rainbow. So this one, I, you know what? I think I'm going to stick with $10 for the something I love. And this one's just going to be... Either tens or five, or if I have more money, then I'll just write the amount down. Okay, it's all colored in. I love these um, markers from Daiso Japan. They are really cute and they work amazing. So this now has 10, 15, $20 and the rainy day fund. I don't even no if i mean i did stuff a little bit i think at the beginning of the month in here i did like a little uh, like not much i think maybe like 60 dollars. i can't remember if it was it was between challenges and sinking funds but i don't think i'll do an end of the month recap just because there's not that much money in there so let's do the $5 challenge. So we'll do one of the $5 challenge. I didn't really think what I was going to stuff before I started filming. So sorry if I'm all over the place, but I was just so excited. I was like, you know what? I got cut like 40 bucks. Let me do something with it before I just go spend it on something I don't need, which is usually what ends up happening, you guys. I do work at Target and that dollar spot just gets me every time so we got five ten fifteen dollars in the five dollar challenge so i work at the front in target so literally the dollar spot is right there and everybody knows sometimes i'll just walk next to it and just look at it and they're like elba don't think about it i bought this this cute little rainbow with the pot of gold it was a dollar so that's the last thing that i bought but i've been trying to control myself but i always 
when I go in and I open and I go in the morning, it's always fun just to see what new things they have put out. And then you kind of also get an idea what like the people are trying to find. I don't know if you guys know like the gumball machines, like people are crazy with those. Like we get so many calls of people. Oh, I'm going to do one of the $10 challenge ones. Like if somebody, I don't know, I guess they have like Facebook, Facebook groups or something where people start like posting what they find at the targets in the dollar spot and then people just start calling over like some of the things and we're like i don't i didn't even know the craze about it and so i started working but the gumball machines i was like what what is this you guys and literally they put them out and i seen like one person come in and take like all 12 of them there sometimes we get two boxes and they're like six in a box and one person will just take all of them and then other people will get upset and be like, hey, she's taking all of them. And like, there's nothing we can do. But the dollar spot can be addicting. So there's $10, $20, $30 in the $10 challenge. But I mean, when I started working there, I was buying more stuff. Like I was kind of spending my money where I didn't need to there. But let's see, we're skipping this one, this one not right now. And then the last one, I think we'll do the mini savings challenge. This one, let's see. We have $13 left. So you know what? I'm going to do $12 in this one. And let's do the green one. And I'm going to put $1 left over in the $1 challenge. That way, I'm able to stuff another extra envelope. And I feel like I've accomplished more than I have been doing. It makes me feel better. So that's what I'm going to do. So let's see. So we're going to add $12 to this one. So let's see how much we have. We have 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, $28 in our mini saving challenge that back in there. I have the money folded in the back so it's not very pretty kind of like the money that I've been getting lately has not been very pretty but whatever still money still works so I guess I shouldn't be complaining and now we get to add one dollar to our dollar saving challenge so let's do a pink one I love pink. There we go. So that's the, yeah. So that's the only thing I'm getting from the dollar spa for this month. I'm just limiting myself and there's pretty much nothing I want. I'm learning to say no to myself. Let's see, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven dollars and our one dollar challenge, you guys. Yay. You know, it makes me so happy to be able to stuff this. I was like feeling kind of sad that I didn't have money to stuff any challenges the last couple of weeks. So I was watching a lot of YouTube videos and it kind of made me like, it kind of made me happy watching other people do it. And I was like, oh, I'm kind of living through them. But I'm very, very happy I was able to do this, you guys. So let me put this to the side. And the skincare ingredient for today is this one right here. It is the Skin Fix 2% BHA Acne Spot Treatment. You guys, this I've just got, uh, I got it, I want to say a week ago. It's uh, my, It was my boyfriend's last goodie bag from Sephora. He started uh, Victoria's Secret this week, so very excited about that. But it was his last goodie bag, and he got a lot of good stuff. He even got some Prada perfumes and, you know, some Drunk Elephants, some Glow Recipe products. But this one, I work at Target, and I do live in L.A., so they changed, like, the type of mask we're able to wear at work. So I was wearing a cloth mask, but now we're wearing the disposable ones like we can't wear the cloth ones anymore like we can wear them but on top of the disposable ones and those have started to make me break out not bad but just like one pimple here one pimple there and oh my god i put this on you guys like no joke within one time 
like I put it on to go to sleep and I woke up like I could definitely see a difference you can put it on in the day and at night time and you can get this at Sephora it's only $30 and it's amazing like the second time after I used it the second day and I woke up the next day like I it was gone I didn't even have a dark spot I don't know if you guys use those little patches I've seen some people use this and have like a dark spot left over in their face nope not with this one you guys so i mean it's been a week and i'm going to continue to use it but i was very impressed by the fact that it worked quickly and it did not leave my any like dark like dark spots on my face because sometimes when i do break out and get like a pimple or two like i have like a mark left over so we're trying not to have any marks on our faces <laughs> we're trying to keep them as bright as we can but this is another one i highly recommend you guys if you guys have any questions you can leave me uh leave them in the comment and i'll respond to all of you guys but um this is it just short and quick and thank you guys for watching thank you everybody for the beautiful comments and all the shout outs from different youtubers you guys chris budges doing shout outs and um it's just a lot of fun you guys and um you know amy budget amy budgets is also doing shout outs so it's really fun to be on here and you know it's really cute so thank you guys for watching if you like go ahead and subscribe and click like on the video and i'll see you guys soon